G'day everyone, welcome to the Smart Body Strength Session. You've heard all about pumping iron, well now you're going to hear all about pumping rubber. We're, each week we're going to give you a 7, 8, 10 different drills to do. We're going to give you a demonstration. Josh is going to be the um, number one demonstrator for, for tonight when we're going to go through seven different drills, um, learning all about techniques with muscle breathing and um, all of that, so have some fun. We're going to get straight into it with the anterior deltoids by the front raise. Now the front raise, we're putting our foot in, not like that, but like that, and basically coming up with our knuckles facing out and bringing your arms up, breathing out, in, exhale, inhale, good, fantastic, keep it going Josh, that's good. Now if you're only gonna come up to this level, that's fine. I don't want you to get into a shaky rhythm type of system. Come up to, listen to your body and come up to where you want to be. Now you can see your mind and muscles going to go obviously here to your shoulders, the front shoulders, that's good, fantastic, great stuff, that's nine, and 10, great. Now let's get into the legs now. We're going to do the lunge on either side. We'll start off lunging down our left foot, so putting our right foot in the middle of the band, getting into a comfortable position, making sure our feet are straight um, at the end. We don't twist them. And we're going to bring our bands up, and slowly come down and up. Two, good. Now again, Come down to where your body lets you come down. You'll find with lunging and squatting that you'll go down further and further as you're doing more reps. So just come down to a comfortable level. Don't do yourself an injury. Keeping your heels straight, that's good. Good. Fantastic, now we'll change sides. Get into a comfortable position like that. Make sure your abdominals are in like they are, that's fantastic. Your heel is at the back is really good. That's a perfect technique. So as I said, listen to your body. Only come down to where you want to come down to and you'll gradually get more and more involved in this and you'll get down further and further. Good. Great. Good stuff. Okay, now we're going to go into the upright row. So with the upright row, we're going to stand basically with our two feet in. We're going to bring our hands around here. Now the idea is to bring our el elbows up, underneath, good. Good, breathing out, in. Exhale, inhale. Exhale, inhale, good. We're now getting our side delts and also getting into the trapezius area here, the traps, so that's really good. You can see with sort of, that's where the mind and muscle technique's going. That's good. Good stuff, well done, good work. Okay, now we're going into the biceps. Now, with the biceps, we're going to just put one foot in the middle, get to a, a position where you're leaning back a little bit, but bending knees, abdominals in, make sure that the core is engaged, and we're just going to come up from here. Now what I'd like to do, we'll just go back to the start and we're just going to go with our hands to the side and then we're going to bring them up. So we're going to have a bit of a twist as well. Always good if you're opening doors, opening beer bottles. That's good. Bringing it up. Again, to your level. You will get stronger and stronger as the weeks go on. So just keep that in mind. And good technique here. See how Josh is just moving the upper part of his arm, the lower. Sorry, the lower part of his arm and keeping the upper part still. That's good. Fantastic. Good work. Now we're going to go into the bent over row. So we're going to get into the middle area of the back here. The rhomboid. So we're going to get them going here. So we're going to bend over us like such. And then we're going to get our, again, our, our palms facing in. And we're going to row up. Good. Keeping that half squat position, so we're getting a little bit of work there on the legs, legs of the glutes as well. Getting an all over compound workout. Good, bringing it all up. Abs in, knees slightly bent, beautiful, yes. Mind and muscle goes into the middle of the back. Fantastic, good stuff. Okay, now we're gonna get into the interior delts. We're going to get into the lat raise. So just one foot, I'd say. You can do two. Actually, you demonstrate the two. I'll demonstrate the one. So depending on 
with obviously if you're stronger like Josh is you can go into the two or you just want to get the, the one arm happening and we'll just come up to the side good breathing out in exhale on exertion inhale good here we go that's fantastic great technique here as I said do this as many times as you can we're almost through the first set I'd like to go around at least a couple of times good so we're going to finish off with an oblique twist and then we're going around again if you can that's nine and ten okay oblique twist so what we're going to do is we're going to get more slack into this so we're sort of standing on a little bit sort of in the middle and then the other one here like that so that's perfect there so we're going to bring that out your right hand out and bring it across moving across like that and moving your whole oblique area the abs moving them over good good work and concentrate mind and muscle obviously goes into the abs area and to the side that you're moving across you see how he's got a perfect stance there keeping nice and straight good it's really good work there we go nine and ten well done so we're swapping it around now and you're going to do ten on the other side again same type of slackness on each side there knuckles out moving over perfect example here so i hope you're doing it at, at home like that so we're just about through our first set so please feel free you can either loop it play it again do the whole lot again you've got them in your book you've got them in your log book you know which seven they are or you can go straight on to the um, sweat session with James or in with Emily to the, uh, to the stretch down. So hope you've had a good time and we'll see you next week and keep strong. Bye.